Hello, and welcome to a high cut short clip about steel engineering BIM. It is now possible to set an individual part type in a BIM process. For example, parts that are welded in a workshop can be assigned another part type as part that are mounted at a construction site. This can be set here in the configuration database. This way parts can be assigned to assembly after the production. A detailed drawing of a part which is not welded to other part could list mounting part, that is the description you've entered in the configuration database. When we take a look at the example here and load the detailed drawing, the title block lists mounting part. This way you can tell this part is not welded to other parts and can be shipped to the construction site. For parts that are welded to other parts, like for example this welding assembly, the detail drawing would list individual part. When we load this detail drawing, the description is also listed in the title block. This information can of course also be listed in a designation tag or in the Helios part list. In addition to the export files step, pdf, nc and dxf for sheet metal parts, it is now possible to have dxf files created for detail drawings. These can be previewed from Helios. When these documents are created is up to the user. This could be as before at the checkup or release, but could for example also occur at the creation of detailed drawings. This also applies for the PDF files. One of the most important renewals is copying or deriving of complete projects, including all linked files. Here we simply copy an already released project. We enter a project number and now all detailed drawings are loaded and reset to the status in process. All index values are reset. A big advantage is that all drawings in which for example extra views and dimensions were created are also available in the copied project and can be reused there. I want to thank you for watching, be sure to check out the other short clips so you don't miss out on other features or improvements. Thank you and have a good day.